Hello everyone and welcome back to Balsa Model Flight Sim. We are currently still in early access open beta at version 0.32.21. And so we are expecting things to not exactly go as they will in the final game. And one thing that I had to change was to turn off the music because on my last video I got a sort of copyright warning. So apparently not all the music is safe. I, I don't know if they were intending for the music to be safe and somebody just decided to copyright that, but I, I'm not going to go into any details. I'll just turn it off for now. And I also uh, fixed my throttle setting. Before the throttle was actually accelerating the throttle, I'll show you what I mean. Uh, so in settings, in input, uh, on the throttle axis, here right now, this is how it's supposed to be. So it is inverted, that's just how it is. And what it was was this relative axis one. And so what that did was when I went down, it would move it down. But even if it was like here in the middle, it would not move that until I got right above the middle and then it would slowly go up, you see. So we do not want that relative axis. So let's continue where we left off. Remote is still under heavy development. There are other options. Uh, there is a sandbox mode. But right now, what I want to do is some missions with my plane that we checked out last time. So, let's see. Touch and go is new. We did the first flight. That says passed. Touch and go. It doesn't really say whether I'm going to get money for it. <laughs> right? I, I want money. Apply a traffic pattern around the field to land. It seems dangerous though. Fly down off the hills and land by the pier or by the beach seems easier. But again, I don't know if there's any reward for this. So I'm just going to use the ascender. Now last time it, it started me in flight. This says precision landing challenge. Land on the runway surrounded by water on all sides that matter. I don't know. Okay, so here we go. Um, the roll is very twitchy. Oh, why? Why can I suddenly see myself? Th that's confusing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why? Uh, I thought, oh, apparently my mouse can control the view. Oh, oh or not so much. Okay, let me change the view because, oh no. <laughs> okay, um, I'm so confused. Land by the, by, at the pier by the beach, right? I wish they had a marker. Whoa, whoa, okay, well, we're clearly in the airplane view here. I don't know what the stall speed of this is, though. At least I have a lot of electric charge. Why do I see myself now? It's so confusing. I mean, am I me? <laughs> am I not me? Uh... This is tough. Uh, oh, oh no! I, I the roll is really wiggly. Oh, oh, oh! Fairing snapped off. Does that count as a landing? You should try it again. Okay. Yeah, I need to reduce the roll. Pace in the team. I, I don't quite get how this is working. All right, but let's release. Repair five only though. That's worth it. Um, let's go back to workshop and reduce the size of the ailerons. Or maybe the authority of the ailerons. I already got them down. I don't know if this actuator option actually does enough. No, oh, these no, that's zero percent roll, so that's fine. Okay, these aren't doing roll, right? 
Yeah, it's just the ailerons, so... Okay, well, let's try it again. Land on the pier by the beach. That was more difficult than I thought. Let's just do this traffic pattern one. Didn't fully appreciate. Um... Okay. Oh, oh. Ow, 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 ow. Well, I, apparently I land. Landed. But I can't take off again? Apparently I can't take off again. It looks like I broke stuff. So, I can't fix it while I'm in the middle of the mission. Okay. Uh oh, the plane is clipped into the guy. Oh, very expensive repair costs. Listen, I need I need money. Um <laughs> This for a scenic jaunt ending on a runway landing at the airbase. Uh let's again I don't see whether I get money or not. So all right. Okay, well, let's put it on the runway and see if we can... Or we can just throw it. Uh, first of all, engine start. And then... Oh, 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 oh! Okay, maybe I should throw it a little bit higher. Hmm. A bit inconvenient. You said it. Okay. Who's this person? Nooks and crannies, a lot of secret place, space, secret places to discover. Okay, well, those are places to discover. I think we'll try this one again. I just threw it wrong. Oh wow, I can't get to that. And yeah. Uh oh oh. And the camera is just too weird right now. Mm. Change view mode? Okay. Yeah, I know it's the wrong way. That's no way to get to a waypoint. Okay, can I just land at the pier? Hold on, you know what? Maybe I should just go for the runway. For once, let me try and land it intact. Oh, this is too fast though. That's a short runway for something this powerful. I think this was all expecting me to have a much less powered plane. But then, this is the only engine we've got. Maybe a one engine version? Okay, now my ability to turn is very limited. Uh, yeah, I can't roll fast enough to get to the runway. Oh gosh. 
But maybe in this direction. Well, we can line up with the thing now, but I've lost most of my battery power. I wish we got... But yeah, I can't roll fast. At all. Uh, no. Ah. Uh, uh, ding me. Come on, come on. Not that one. Ah, I can't get to that one. Oh no, trees! Okay, we missed a tree. Oh, oh no! Oh, we landed. Sort of. Uh, things snapped off. Okay, well. Yeah, this is. There are no weapons, no kidding. I guess I accidentally pressed the key for the weapons. Flight time, three minutes though. We got some. But we really go too fast. What I need is a cheaper, more reliable plane. Sorry, Ascender. Whoa, that was dramatic. Okay. Let's let's be a little bit more reasonable reasonable about things. Aero stability, and then let's get the oh the center of lift is already indicated. Okay, once you turn that on, it looks like it stays on. And sometimes I don't get the whole part placement thing. Sometimes, like right there. Maybe I can just go with that and then move it. Uh. Can we change that simulator speed? How slow can we go with this? Is what I want to know. Where is our stall speed? Uh, basically we get instability starting out around there-ish. And we need a 3 degree angle of attack just to stay flying at 50 kilometers per hour. 80 kilometers per hour it seems fine. Okay, I do think that the ailerons were underdone a bit last time. So let's go to maybe 20%. This lighter now, and we don't need two batteries. So let's go into internal view. Oh, uh, it looks like I didn't even have the batteries in here. It was in the nose cone. So we need a battery. No reference exception. We've got abnormal mesh bounds. Hmm. Okay, so let's just make sure. Well, it doesn't seem to. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that works. Uh, let's give a little bit of a tilt to the wings. Gone with a V tail. Don't know if that's the best thing. Maybe I shouldn't do that. <laughs> Let's just not do that. Let's keep this as simple as possible. Okay. That should not be yaw anymore. Oh, well, why don't I go auto? Aha! I figured it out on auto. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Those should not be doing roll. Auto doesn't understand. It, so. Maybe I should just skip the flaps. Because they're not going to operate as flaps anyway. And we'll just have very outboard ailerons. Alright. We'll, we'll call this... Simplex one. Every effort has been made to keep this simple. Let's see if that pays off.
Uh, yeah, we've reduced, we've, we've saved money. Uh oh, it's jittery. Um, let me just pick that up for a sec. <laughs> oh, wow. Um, that's probably not a good sign for landing. Okay, well, we'll try it. Let me, um, oh, 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 I can't pull up, I can't pull up, I've done something wrong. Ouch. Okay. All right, you guys were supposed to do pitch. You are doing pitch. Um, yeah, that would be pitch the right way, all right. That nose goes up, that nose goes down. Yep. I'll just test fly it without a uh, mission or anything. Okay, this view is definitely not the right view. <laughs> okay, that view does not let me change anything. I can't, we can't fly the vehicle in that view. Return. Can't recover the vehicle right now. Is that because it's twitching on the ground? It seems to have a mind of its own as far as what it wants to do in life. Maybe I should just let it go. Oh, there's actually a recovering time. Well, let me just buy an ascender. Yeah. Let's increase the roll on it. Yeah, my frustration in this episode has mainly been with the camera, which does not seem to do what I think it should do. Uh, I seem to have control over it, but the camera is really weird. Okay. Yeah, I have control over this one. Well, let me just do some flight practice, darn it. Can we just land properly once? The roll feels a lot better right now. I need like a checkerboard pattern on the hill to as a reference or something. That goodness, the wire isn't a detriment. Um, let's go around and try and land from this direction. Oh, uh, 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 no. Bad approach. Oh, the wind sound has died on us. <laughs> okay. It sputtered a bit, let's put it that way. Do you suppose it's trying to tell me, like... Oh gosh. Uh, nope. I'm gonna abort that one too. Do I get points for going into the ring? Let me just see how... How slow can I go without it killing this? Oh, it's feeling bad. It's 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 not able to lift its nose up. Ah... Uh, it's awkward trying to land in this view. Uh, and... We are definitely not... Uh, we're rolling all over the place still. And the yaw doesn't get to the runway. Uh, well, I'll set a record for how long I fly, but they're not going to give me money for it. Uh, uh, okay, brakes, brakes. 
How do I break? Uh Oh. Gosh, that's a long landing roll. Okay. I think that's our first intact landing, right? Yes. It is completely intact, folks. We'll need to recharge it, though. Alright, we'll try the touch and go again. Oh, we have to go through those things. Uh, I can't. Hopefully those are just guidelines. Apparently not. Okay, we're gonna have to hit that first ring then. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, no, I can't get that. I don't have that much roll. Can I get this one? Okay, I'll have to go around again. Oh, maybe I can get the- uh, I can't get that one. Uh, uh, I can't- okay, well, I'm cleared. That doesn't mean I have to do it this time. <laughs> I'll go around one more time. I want I want to keep this thing intact after all. I wonder how to zoom out on the map. Okay, okay, uh I wonder what safe landing speeds are. Okay, well a landing gear snapping off is not bad. How do I have brakes on this thing? <laughs> how do I stop it? Okay, one landing gear snapped off. We had we had redundant forward landing gear anyway. Yes. Did I get any points or money or anything? No funds earned. Too bad. I guess I have to fly through all the gates. Well, flight time nine minutes. Uh, it must have been including something else. Oh, that's probably. I guess that's total for that vehicle. Okay. All right, that's total for the vehicle. I, I mistook that for just for the one flight. Okay. Hmm. This mission time was three minutes and forty-three seconds. Damage caused, damage taken, deaths, shots fired. Well, we did some things. I. I'm not feeling perfect about this whole situation. At least that's not too expensive to repair. The problem is I have. I mean, I guess they pay us money for fulfilling these things, but they don't say how much they're going to pay. So I can't make an educated decision about what to do, whether I want to take this event or that event. It says three colored tags here, but I don't know what those mean. So instead of continuing in career mode, let me just quickly take a look at what parts are available in the more sandbox situation. So let's just go, there's a multiplayer too, by the way, but let's see, sandbox, just go to the workshop. That co We have nine cockpits. This one looks like a more traditional jet fighter cockpit. That tandem one is what we've been using. And then that's more like a bomber. So those are the cockpits. Fuselages. We've got one with a built-in tail gear it looks like a uh, box frame like for a biplane so these are biplane parts beams various common shapes so we can have crew I mean not, not crew passengers apparently these are passenger parts uh, we've got a cargo bay with a drop bay in case you wanted to bomb something Okay, and that seems like a nose gear sort of deal. We got a rocket motor. This is a 412 watt. So what we've been using so far 
is uh, I think this 185 watt one, the Wurub B, and then there's a backwash which is 320. Weighs quite a bit more though. The thrust to weight ratio is probably not as good. This one is 412 watts, and then you can put a rocket motor. Various aerodynamic surfaces. Of course, they're very tweakable and shapeable. But. Yeah. We'll have to see what the limitations are in practice. So you got that one battery, and there's this battery. That one is smaller and 64 amp hours. This one is 240. I think this is the one we've been using though. There's a proper fuel tank, six units, so we're on units here. That's a 40 unit fuel tank. I suppose um, this says watts, but that's a combustion engine. So even though it's measured in watts, that is a engine that will use the fuel. Two bladed, three bladed, and four bladed propellers, super capacitor, and we've uh, so we've we haven't been we've been introduced to many of the parts, and this is a smogomatic smoke generator, Warbird cockpit sight gun sight, and then two cannons, a uh, thud and a maelstrom. Sorry, hailstorm. And then two possible passengers. So, those are the parts that are available right now. Interesting. I mean, I've seen people make quite a lot of things out of these. So, I uh, I need to I need to actually find out more about how to how career is meant to be played because I feel like I'm doing it wrong, and I need a lot more flight practice in this game. So with that, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below, and I'll see you next time.